I am Pastor Josephat Rubiuka, currently pastoring in the North East Kenya field of the Seventh-day Adventist Church, the pastor for Motin Pastoral District in uh, Nyambene Station. I am here today for an evangelistic campaign that was starting on, on Sunday, and today we are doing our fourth day. We want to thank the Lord for the fire he has led us. The place where I am studying now is Kachoroni Center. Our evangelistic center is called Kachoroni in the lower parts of Varaka. Varaka is a community that is sparsely populated in most of, the, the, most of its parts and especially the lower region where we are because of drought and uh, insufficient rains. Today I want to thank the Lord because since we started our evangelistic efforts in these areas where actually I started my ministerial work, I pastored in this region for one and a half years before I was transferred to another place and another place where I am currently serving. I want to thank the Lord because since the time I was here, due to the efforts that have been made and specifically by our division leader, Pastor Bracious Ruguri, who has sponsored several evangelistic meetings. We have seen many people being converted and this one is going to be one of those meetings whereby we expect many souls to be converted and be baptized into the Adventist faith. Our attendance here is quite impressive, especially considering the fact that this area is sparsely populated and that some people are coming from very far to, as they walk to this place so that they can listen to the meetings. They are finding it very interesting. We can see here we have children, we have mothers who have children, and of course we have older men here who have also joined us to enjoy the meeting, whereby we are having video presentations, PowerPoint sermons that are very captivating to them. We are also having heart-touching and converting songs in Swahili, uh, which is very well known the language here. We want also to thank the Lord for the speakers we have. We have been beginning in good time at 5 p.m. and we end at about 8.45, between 9 and 8.45, though today we are likely to end at 9 because we had visitors who came to visit with us. Others, I want to thank the Lord because the attendance is quite impressive. We do visitations every day. Yesterday we were able to visit about 25 people. Today, because of some of the people we met in Indian some time with us, we, were, we managed to visit only 15. But we intend to increase the group, or increase the members whom, who shall accompany us in visitations beginning tomorrow. And so we expect to meet more people. Already some people have given their lives for baptism, even before we even sp speak about baptism in these meetings. So we really appreciate what the Lord is doing to us. People have many concerns. Some are concerned with their health. Others are concerned with their businesses. And that's why we are striving and trying our best to see to it that our presentations meet their need as much as possible. And so I want to thank the Lord for that and say, the Lord being with us, we expect to baptize more than 20 people here. And I also to want to appreciate that the Maranatha International are putting up a church near this place whereby the members that are being baptized will be worshipping. They have also been very excited after hearing from their local pastor, Pastor Julius Kabete, who has announced that Maranatha International are also planning to dig a borehole, which is going to go a long way in providing for them. Now that water is also an issue here, they buy water every day. And so they will greatly appreciate once the water has been dug, the bow has been dug and constructed, and they are looking forward to that. Actually, yesterday as we were going around, we found one lady and one man who said that they want to participate in the construction of the borehole. They are going to make sure they collect some ballast because they feel this is part of them and is part of their society. They greatly appreciate our coming and they appreciate the donors who are providing for these things. So they are very happy generally. We are also enjoying our time here and we 
pray that the Lord stays with us to the end of this meeting.